Elon Musk joined Twitter and tried to burn it to hell. He laid off 90% of the workforce. The Twitter team released the Twitter's recommendation algorithm. Let's see if you can use this algorithm to actually get popular on Twitter. And that too in just 100 seconds. So this is the complete architecture of Twitter. You can see a lot of big boxes in it. Let's go through them. The first thing to recommend you any tweet is to fetch the best tweets which are relevant to you. Now there are a lot of people tweeting all around the globe. There are a lot of people you are connected to. So let's see what would be the candidate sources for it. Would it be just the people who are in your network who are tweeting? No. So the candidate sources are two. Work the people you are directly connected with. 50% comes from the people who you are not connected to at all. Now let's first consider the first thing which is the in sources. For this Twitter constructs something called a real graph. It is a directed and a weighted graph where the nodes are the Twitter users which are you and the edges are labeled with the interactions between different pairs of users. So according to Twitter's research paper, there are two types of interaction, visible interactions in which you like the tweet, you favorite their tweet or implicit interaction when you click on someone's tweet or link within the tweet or you visit their profile page. Now for each of these interactions, they collect a lot of data. First, the number of days between when such interaction happens, the mean and variance, the number of days since the first interaction of this type happened. So if your interests are changing with time, they also take this into account. Now the second is the out of the network tweets. So for these, it will see what tweets did the people you follow engage with and who likes similar tweets like you do. And once all of this is done, the candidate sources are ranked using logistic regression. There might be various similarities between a lot of people. A lot of people might be interested in the same kind of things. So Twitter uses an algorithm to cluster these types of people into one community and show them same kinds of tweets. Even after this, there are a lot of candidates. Now you still have to rank them in particular order so that your feed can be created. So for this, Twitter uses a neural network. It is a 48 million parameter neural network. Your life and your popularity on Twitter is already kind of determined by AI or artificial intelligence. So people might be still talking about how AI will replace us or do anything with it. But your life is still controlled by algorithms which are embedded in these neural networks.